see though. Anything I want, I'll search. I will tell, I will ask Gogo. <laughs> Let me ask Gogo how to, to, to do this thing. I think I'm there. I think I'm there. What's funny? I think I see something. Are you cooking? Hey! Cooking! I think, hey! Auntie, oh! Gogo, Auntie, Auntie, what do you mean? Auntie, Gogo, no! 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 Kiss somebody in this house, so she left her food to burn simply because she's using the gun. Jesus! Hmm? Hmm? What is this? What's up, bro? Hmm. Uh, Are you good? Uh, yes, I'm good. I'm Are you good. sure? Yeah, we're just playing with um, colors. Oh, really? Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. Thank you. I'll, I'll get back to you. Alright. Yeah. Auntie Why are you shouting? And everything you used to shout. Oh, I need to say you be happy. What is, what is this? It's Miko. Hey! It's like you will be happy. I need a room. I mean, what told you this is how makeup looks like? Uh, is it no? Um, <laughs> it's Gogo. It's Gogo. Hey. It's Gogo. <laughs> it's Gogo. <laughs> it's Gogo. Gogo. See, Atilena, mm -hmm. if I told you got this information from Gogo, then you must have used the wrong website. Hmm. You said anything I want. I should, I should ask Gogo. Go, 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 say, I should, I should make up and look sexy. Mm, can't you see that? Uh, I'm looking sexy now. Hey, sexy with all this. Mm, husband. What we are going to do now is you go to that bathroom, mm -mm. wash this whole thing off, and we're going to start all over again. I will teach you how to go to the right website and get what you want. Mm -hmm. This is completely a mess. Mess. This is not how to look sexy for your husband. Hey. This piece of clothes should be left behind there in the village. You don't need it here. Hmm. This wrapper is no piece of clothes. Okay, so. this wrapper would have been left in the village. You don't need it here. Mm. Please, go to the bathroom and wash. Please. You, you buy me all these things. So you, you buy me all. No problem. I'll buy you. I'm not buy you. I'll even buy twice the size you have now. Going to the village to bring a village wife, not be not be the beginning of the end of my life. Please, hi. Thank you, my dear. Hey, since now they have not seen you I've what? just been busy, busy, busy. Okay. Hi. See? Mm -hmm. Don't say something. What? Hey, do you know that my, my, my husband's sister is back? The one I <laughs> saw when I was coming. <laughs> hey, she's the one. She came back from, hey, um, Obudo Ibo. What do you used to call it? USA. <laughs> USA. Oh, I see. Hey. Hey. So, um, but I think, you know what happened the day she came back? What mm -hmm. happened? Hey. How did she came back? She came back with my husband. Eh? Mm. So, and I hug my husband, do. Mm. Eh? Mm. So, I wanted to hug that my husband's sister. Hey! Auntie, she pushed me. 
Don't say. And she, she, she pushed you. She pushed me. And what did your husband do about it? Husband no talk. Husband no say anything. I said it. Hey. Uh -huh. Continue. What happened? I nearly fought that man that day. Uh -huh. Is that how all this Oyibo police do? For where? Hey. See, let me tell you. The moment I came in hmm. and I saw that lady, I knew she was wicked. Look, that lady, she has come to scatter your home. Hey. Wicked that was written all over her face. Hey. She was oozing of wickedness. Mm -hmm. Let me say. See, mm -hmm. um, those people used to do job, job. Me wrestling. Yes. Mm -hmm. That one that I used to wear black, and that one I used to wear blue. Mm -hmm. I want that one. I used to wear those. That one I used to wear black. And see, I'm mistaking me, eh? Throw this thing, wow. Child. She went and tell my husband that. Mm -hmm. I Wait. Threw, she I... reported it to your husband. Yes. Has it gotten to that point? No. Mm -hmm. I mean, she just got here and she's already reporting you to your husband. Mm -hmm. I mean, what is she going to do next if she's already reporting you to your husband? No, no. Don't you think you need to be wise? Mm. You are too soft. Mm. Open your eyes, spread your wings. This is your husband's house. Mm. That lady has come. She has come to stay. Mm. She see all this thing she's doing, Americana, Americana, is to deceive you. She has. Do you, how sure are you she's even your husband? Your husband's my husband's sister. Mm. Mm. So you must shut your eyes, though. That lady, she has come to chase you out of here. She don't Back. Mm. 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 I see you have a guest. Guest, oh. Now. What of your husband? Mm. My husband is sleeping. Eh. Yeah. Um, you know, you're my very good friend. Mm. Yeah, you know, I care about I you. Know. I just decided to share this small secret with you. You know, mm. yes, because I love you so much. <laughs> and um, uh, yes, uh, I just want to help you. Mm. There is this thing that city women do eh, to keep their marriage. Mm. Eh? Mm. Nobody else will, will show you this thing. It's because I love you. Okay. People don't normally. You know, mm. give it out like that, and mm. it took me a lot to get it though. Ah. So you have to appreciate it. Okay, don't tell anybody. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. So my dear, mm -hmm. you see this thing. Mm -hmm. uh, if you put it in your husband's food, mm -hmm. God, you will be the only person your husband will be seeing. Mm -hmm. Once he wakes up in the morning like this, the only thing he will see is Auntie <laughs> If he goes to the toilet, Auntie Nena. Mm -hmm. When he's when he's bathing, Auntie Nene, everything he does, Auntie Nene, mm. you will be the only woman your husband will be seeing. Mm -hmm. Your husband will love you. He will overlove you. Mm. Whatever you ask him, he will give you. Mm. And you know I like you, and I cannot deceive you. Mm. So take this thing. Uh, put it in your husband's food. Ah mm. uh, yes. Once he eats it, in the way he will love you. Mm. Uh, everything is set. Mm. 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 No! Don't ah, I can't harm you now. I can't do anything that will. Uh, uh, but don't show it to me. Uh, uh, you have to keep this thing between us. Yes. Uh, uh, I can perceive something. Yes, I'm you for my husband. Hey, this is the right time to go. What's the dish is food? Sprinkle it on it. Uh, you put food. Yes. <laughs> as much as you can. I love you. Yes. Thank you. Check my phone. Okay, oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.
上你弄，弄弄弄弄。Beautiful evening. You know, I've been meaning to ask. Why did you get married to such timid, led notion, Bill? Judith. That timid, local, village girl gives me happiness. She gives me peace. As a matter of fact, I feel more safe with her than any of these city girls. Well, you could have gotten some classy city girls out there. There are a lot of them, know you. Mm. You know, I was into lots of relationships before I left Nigeria for the United States. And my experiences with them is something I, I, I don't wish for anybody. So I searched and I think I know what I found. Yeah, you're talking about class, you're talking about status, but I want you to understand that class, age, skin color, location, religion, family, tribe, and others don't matter when a man is in search for peace of mind and happiness. Okay. That's a business anyway. I think I'll be going back to the States soon. Like, I'm already planning on that. Really? Yes. I'm tired and I can't deal with her dramatic nature anymore. It's alright. If you've made up your mind, go back. Then I don't have no problems with that. But how about you? you teach teach her a little bit on how to be that city girl and your ideal sister-in-law. Seriously, bro? Mm -hmm. I thought you were gonna kick her ass out or something and get some classy city girl to come be your wife. I can't babysit a full-grown adult. Oh, come on. I think I will get used to it with time. Meanwhile, you can do that for your brother, won't you? I will, but I'm not gonna do that for your charge. Don't pay for it. <laughs> Judith, you should have said this try from the start. You're paying for it, bro. A first class ticket back to LA. Seriously? Mm -hmm. Oh, is that a deal? Then a deal it is. <laughs> Yes, I've observed the recent development in this house. And if care is not taken, one of those gold diggers you call friends to take your husband away from you. <laughs> now listen to me. I reached an agreement with my bro to teach you before going back to the States. And I'm gonna do that. Okay? So before we begin our lecture, you go in. Pick up a book and a pen. Eh? Yeah. Pen and paper. Yeah, to jot things down. Because I'm going to lecture you. Pen and paper. Go get a book and pen. Go. Sit. Hmm. Sit down and write. Yes, you're going to jot things down because I'll be lecturing you. Alright, first, you're going to have to do it with those things you call friends, those gold diggers. You are looking for someone's husband to take away from her. Because if you don't, you're going to lose your husband to some city gold diggers. Huh? Yes. <laughs> 
celebrating that. Yes. Secondly, you should wear good clothes. Dress sexy to attract your husband. Sexy. Yes. When I say sexy, I don't mean those pieces of clothes you just tie around your neck, you fly around the whole house. I mean good clothes. Thirdly, you should get some good perfumes, good body spread, your friends, wear them always and smile good. That will also make you look attractive to your husband. You need to smell good for God's sake, a woman. Okay? Then your hair, you should make them. Get yourself some good stylist, make your hair. Always look good. Okay? Mm. Now, the next thing is food. You should like to cook good food. Not giving him some fufu and soup all the time. You will make him add too much waste and that is not good. Then another important point. You should stop trying to push him down whenever he comes back from work. <laughs> Hug him gently. Touch him. Kiss him. Peck him. Give him a gentle hug and a gentle touch. Don't always push him down. You're gonna hurt him one day. You should hug him gently. You human you should be soft. Women are meant to be soft, not rough. Then while you walk, please try raising your feet up. Your foot wears makes a lot of noise. Always raise your feet while walking. Okay? Hope you understood everything I said to you. Yes, ma. It's not all about writing it down. You should marry your book. As you've written them down, try to study them. If you don't study them and practice them, you're gonna lose your husband to your friends. That's all I have to say to you. Okay. Hey, <laughs> Thank you. All right. <laughs> Auntie, eh? yeah. you mean if I do all these things, my husband will love me more, more, more. Of course, he will. <laughs> I, should, I should marry my book. Yes. And leave my husband. No, that's not what I mean. I mean you should read those things, practice them, not leaving your husband to get married to some book. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was there. Good afternoon, sir. Ain't you the lady I saw the other day with my wife? Yes, your wife's friend, Bianca. Oh, okay. Uh, my wife is not home, okay? She went shopping with my sister. Okay, I suggest you check back later, huh? Uh, uh, excuse me. Actually, I didn't come to see your wife. I came to see you. I actually came dressed like this. Because I know that I wouldn't trust you. Come on. Don't tell me you're a handsome man like you. Don't like me. Um, I, 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 I love Atene now, okay? Please, can you just leave my house now? Please. Fine, fine, fine. You, you don't need to shout. I'll leave. Thank you. Better. Just go. And I hope it will interest you to know that your so-called Auntie Nena poisoned you the other day. What? Have a good day. Uh, please, please, um, did you, what did you just say? You heard me right, and I suppose you're not deaf. Please, don't go, okay? Don't go, I, I just want to hear some more. Come, have a seat, please. Okay. Please, please, tell me some more. I want to hear. Tell me, how did this happen? I guess your so-called wife is with her boyfriend right now. Huh? And guess what? They are planning to kill you and run away with your properties. The lucky you're still alive. You, 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 you're kidding me, ain't you?
Tinena. She looks innocent. Like the same. The devil you know is better than the angel you don't know. Do you need it to be written all over her face before you can know that she reeks of wickedness? Oh my god. Okay. I knew if I had come here without evidence, you wouldn't believe it. So, you watch this. Food. I ate it. Ah! I did it. How long has this been going on? Let's say you are just lucky to be alive. Might not be next time. Reason is why you need me around you to watch your back. I thought I would be safer with the village girl. So she'd be pretending the whole time? <laughs> <laughs> 